Welcome back gamers to another JGM Gaming video. In this video I want to share with you an awesome spot that I found for farming Relic of Ulduar. Uh, this is probably even the best spot to farm them that I've found so far. Um, I say it's the best spot because it is a hyper spawn location meaning there will always be mobs for you to kill here and they do have a high drop chance for the relics as well. Now before we begin I want to quickly say that only 0.7% yes you read that right 0.7% of my viewers are subscribed to the channel so if you like these sorts of videos I would immensely appreciate it if you could subscribe to the channel to see future content like this. With that out of the way let's begin. So for anyone who is unaware, Relic of Ulduar is a much sought after item in Wrath of the Lich King Classic because you can hand in 10 of them as a repeatable quest. The quest is called Hodair's Tribute and it gives you 500 Sons of Hodair reputation every time you hand it in. And people will be wanting Sons of Hodair reputation mainly to get the best in slot shoulder enchants as well as some epics are available as well and a mount. So I'm sharing with you the exact spot that I used to farm my Relic of Ulduar to help get my Sons of Hoda reputation all the way to Exalted. This farm takes place in a cave in the Storm Peaks called Frost Grips Hollow. There are also lots of other goodies in this cave that make this farm even better for some of you. So I'll get into the uh, prices, what you can achieve here later when I uh, when I check all the uh, auction prices. But for now, um, let's just say this cave is quite small, which means the mobs are fairly close together. So you can quickly go from one kill to the next and clear your way through the cave very fast. There may be people here already, as there was when I was farming. That's because there are quests that take place in this cave, but because of the fact that it is a hyper spawn, it doesn't matter if this spot is contested, because mobs will be constantly respawning for you. You can actually see here a few times in this video, I kill a mob and one respawns in its place instantly, or I get a spawn behind me after killing something in front of me, for example. You just won't run out of mobs to kill here, which is why this is the best location, in my opinion, for farming Relic of Ulduar. You're also going to be getting Frostweave Cloth, uh, roughly 10 to 50 silver per kill, plus some Vendor Greys, and of course you have chance for um, World Drops here as well. In this cave you can also find Ice Thorn, Lich Bloom, and Saranite Ore, so for those of you with mining and or herbalism, this farm will be even better. These mobs are around level 78 to 79, so you can still do this farm while you're leveling up to get experience and make gold at the same time. My realm is a PvP realm and quite heavily populated with Alliance, so if I was doing this farm for gold, then my gold earned per hour would probably be less than yours. Let's take a look at the current average price for Relic of Ulduar across both EU and US realms. You can see here that the current average EU market value is 2 gold and 69 silver each and the current average US market value is slightly higher at 2 gold 98 silver each. These prices were obviously accurate at the time of recording but of course they will fluctuate throughout the expansion. So with all of these different various drops taken into account it means this spot should be getting you around 500 to 600 gold per hour if you're doing this as a gold farm. Obviously dependent on your particular realm's prices, but that should provide a pretty accurate estimate uh, based on my calculations while I was farming here uh, and based on the average prices across realms. So I hope you enjoyed today's video and once again I would really appreciate it if you could subscribe to the channel for future content like this and I'll catch you in the next one.